Hey, Joystick News fam, today we're venturing back into the awe-inspiring landscapes and intense historical tapestry of Ghost of Tsushima, but with a twist. Lauren Beeler Baystad has just shed light on what could be the next thrilling chapter in our samurai saga, focusing on the potential that lies in exploring the second Mongol invasion of Japan in Ghost of Tsushima 2. Buckle up, because this journey is about to take us through a storm of possibilities, both literal and metaphorical. The historical backdrop, a second storm brewing. Ghost of Tsushima has not only captivated us with its breathtaking open world exploration and deeply personal storyline, but also by immersing us in a pivotal moment in Japanese history. As Jin Sakai, we've defied traditional samurai honor to protect Tsushima Island from the Mongol invasion in 1974. Yet history didn't stop there and neither should our story. The Mongols returned for a second invasion in 1281, a narrative goldmine for Ghost of Tsushima 2. A seasoned warrior, Jin Sakai's evolution. Imagine a sequel that propels us seven years into the future. Jin Sakai, now older, wiser, and more formidable, faces the daunting challenge of the second invasion. This isn't the same young samurai we left at the end of the first game. This Jin has lived through the horrors of war, made peace with his controversial choices, and stands ready to defend his home with a maturity and ferocity we've yet to see. The potential for character development here is immense offering a deeper dive into Jin's psyche and the heavy burden of leadership and survival. Man via nature, the divine wind. But what truly sets the second invasion apart is the dramatic and historical intervention of nature itself. Just as the Mongols seemed unstoppable, a massive typhoon famously known as Kamikaze or divine wind devastated their fleet, playing a crucial role in safeguarding Japan from occupation. This cataclysmic event could transform Ghost of Tsushima 2 into a tale of man vs. Nature, adding a raw, unpredictable force that Jin must navigate alongside the Mongol threat. Into the heart of the storm, gameplay mechanics. Imagine the gameplay possibilities that come with integrating this environmental catastrophe. Battles against the Mongol invaders could be intensified by raging storms, challenging players to adapt to fierce winds and torrential rain, affecting visibility, movement and strategy. This could add a whole new layer of immersion and complexity to the combat system, pushing Jin's skills and the player's adaptability to their limits. A story of resilience and survival. Ghost of Tsushima 2 could become a testament to the resilience of the human spirit and the unyielding forces of nature that shape our history. By focusing on the second Mongol invasion, Sucker Punch has the opportunity to explore themes of survival, adaptation, and the indomitable will to protect one's home against all odds, both human and natural. Wrapping up the path forward. As we speculate on the future of Jin Sakai and the island of Tsushima, one thing is clear, Ghost of Tsushima 2 holds the potential to surpass its predecessor, not just in terms of narrative depth and character development, but in setting a new benchmark for how video games can explore and honor historical events. What are your thoughts on the direction Ghost of Tsushima 2 could take? Are you ready to stand with Jin against the fury of the Mongols and the wrath of nature itself? Let us know in the comments below and don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more gaming news and insights. Until next time, keep your blades sharp and your spirit unbroken.